Hey, thanks for tuning in to this week's Monday Motivation. My name is Tony Ruiz, and I'm the founder and host of the Productive Agent Podcast and Facebook group. The purpose of our Monday Motivations is to give you a quick message to make you think, be inspired, and motivated to start your week. Today's Monday Motivation is entitled Plant the Seeds. So I was driving this morning to um, my accountability group, and I was listening to Andy Frisella's Real AF like I do most mornings. And it was episode 519. It aired today. So if you want to go check that out, it's one of his Q&AF episodes. And the last 13 minutes really spoke to me. And I wanted to share that with you. Um, His listeners will um, drop in questions either in his YouTube channel or email them to him. But the question was, this guy asked, what were some of your fears when starting out in business and how did you get over them? And he said that you should have some sense of fear when you start your business. And the most important thing that you can do is focusing on planting seeds every single day. And uh, he said, if you judge your day or week or month by what you got out of the day, all right, you will be disappointed more times than not. So don't worry about what you're getting out of every single day. What you need to focus on and worry about is what you're actually putting into the day or you didn't put into the day for whatever reason. You control the input, not the outcome, right? So if we just focus on making sure that we're continuing to plant seeds consistently on a daily basis, we're gonna, our outcome will be better because of it. All right, so this really resonated with me and I just wanted to share it with you. So just kind of thinking about how does this apply to us, right? What seeds are you going to plant today tomorrow and the rest of the week, right? Maybe it's a health and fitness that you really wanna focus on. Maybe you can focus on working out daily and planting that seed or drinking more water, right? I'm trying to get back to having a gallon a day, which I was doing during the 75 hard challenge and it was great, but I kind of have um, backed that off, but I wanna bring that back up. So that's one of the seeds I'm planting daily. I'm making healthier choices in what you eat. And I'm also committing to reading um, more often and daily uh, than what I've been over the past few weeks. Uh, If you want to focus on business, what kind of seeds can you plant there? Uh, Making at least 10 contacts a day would be a great seed to plant, right? Staying in flow with your people. Posting to social media consistently would be another great seed that you can plant. A weekly email, making sure that goes out every single week. Those are great seeds, and I'm sure you can come up with others. Well, what if you really want to focus on building relationships, right? Staying in contact with your friends and family. When was the last time that you talked to old coworkers? Uh, reach out to them, see how they're doing, see what they're up to, right? Setting up a coffee or a lunch or a dinner with those people and catching up with them. Making future plans with friends and family. Hey, we got a vacation coming up. Hey, you know, that time that we went somewhere, that was a lot of fun. What if we do that again? So those are great ways to plant those seeds to continue to build those relationships. And if we focus on planting seeds every single day, we will watch your life grow as you reap a plentiful harvest. So that's the message today. I want you um, to think about that. What kind of seeds can you plant today and going forward uh, so you can reap that plentiful harvest? I hope you enjoyed the show. If you did, I would encourage you to share it with a friend or family who could use this message as well. Uh, Leave us a review. Give us a rating that really helps us grow the shows and impact others like you. If you're in the real estate business or thinking about getting in the real estate business, I'd encourage you to join our private Facebook group called The Productive Agent. You could also follow us on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. And all of the links are in the show notes. Thank you for joining us today. Now let's get out there and go produce.